Alright, today I'm going to do a little extra side thing to go along with adding a featured image. Now, if you're adding your own image, that's fabulous. Um, but if you don't have one of your own images to use and you would like to add one to your post, uh, there's a few steps that you do need to go through because obviously you can't just go and use anyone's image. Now, if you're just starting a new post, you can do it the usual way. I'm going to go add one to one of my older ones. Let's go to this one, Conversations and Connecting. So if I just click on that, I suppose this is also, you can get to editing from here, or if you go back here, you can edit your posts through all posts in the posting section. That was a lot of times to say posting once. Um, but you can go through this way as well if you're just going through it. Now it's got a photo, but I haven't put a header photo on it. So I'm just going to go and edit this one. I can shut that. You see I've added all, I've added lots of categories. And I'll go down here and I don't have a set featured image. Now it's about connecting and having conversations with educators through Facebook. So I want to do something along the lines of connecting. Now what you are going to want to use to find an image that is suitable and someone has given permission, you are going to want to use CC Search. And you can just look through Google for that. Just type in CC Search. It's much quicker than trying to type in this URL. And I'm going to look for Connect. Now, there's a few different options here. So we can go, let's go to Google first. And it will load and it will bring up a bunch or collection of images that people have given permission for you to use. Now, this one's OK. But obviously, there's a lot of cars. Uh, what you will notice is that it, it, it will be harder to find an image that you want. Uh, let's jump over to Flickr now. And I really like Flickr because it tells you what sort of attribution you have to give as well. Now, I really liked, I like this first one. So let's click on that. And down here, it's got some rights reserved. Now, if we click on that, it'll tell us what it means. See, they were good. They linked theirs, so it opens up separately. So with this image, we are free to share. So we're free to uh, copy and re redistribute the material in any medium or format. And we're able to adapt it so we can add some other text to it if we wanted to. And then you can just see down here. You must give appropriate credit, provide a link to the license and indicate if changes were made. You may do so in a reasonable manner, but not in a way that suggests the licensor endorses you or your use. Now, there's a bunch of different um, attributions, but this one we are free to do. We just have to give an attribution. And the way we do that, so we can get rid of this now, So what we're going to do is we are going to, we don't need it too big, so let's just get it in a medium. We can download this image and we'll save that. Now, keep this page open. Because what we are going to do is we're going to go down here and we're going to set the featured image. We're going to go and upload it from my desktop. That's the one it is. And we don't need a title. And we're going to go back here because we want to give credit. And here, he, this guy has actually popped down here. Feel free to use this photo on your site. All I ask is that you credit my website here as the source. Now, if someone hasn't given that there, I would credit this page directly. Um, you can copy this entire URL or if you've got a URL shortener, which I do recommend you get because it makes everything look much nicer. Um, it'll give you a shortened one and you can copy that. But this guy's already given us something uh, to credit. So we are just going to copy that link. And over here in the caption, we're going to say photo via or photo from. And we're just going to paste that link. Let's make that. So let's look at that. And we're going to set the featured image. Now, if you didn't want to put the link there or you felt like you wanted to give them you know, two different credits. You can actually add it in your post here. So at the bottom, you can say uh, 
photo buyer and put it there as well. I'm going to just pop that to the side. So always using CC search when you're adding not your image. Um, yeah, and that's about it. Thanks, guys.